we have um, four records. So I will remove this first one. Well, let me leave, let me quickly copy this and paste here, so we can still maintain our four record. And let's go to our controller. So let me quickly use this at the front end whereby a user can easily just access the blog. So I will create a link quick short quickly. So let me go to my front end. I'll go to layout. I'll say either and I will add blog to it. I'll say block. Blog. So let me quickly be sure of what we had it, which is this. And we don't have the page yet. So let me go to um, our controller and quickly duplicate one of our controller. I'll call it blog. So I'll say blocks is equal I'll say find all so I will return this score render I'll say index so I'll say block and uh, what's our index? Mm, let me quickly create it folder. I'll call it block. Um, Then to place a table. Um, then I'll say C C R. C D. So I'll duplicate this, which is going to be in for each. I call it blocks as block. Undefined blocks. I need to pass it to the view. So we need to make each of the topic a link. And I will say you should go to 
blog and let's say view and um, we'll pass the ID let's say title ID should become blog slug good so you can just easily make use this to view not found. Let me quickly do that as well before we go. Uh, let me duplicate um, this. I call it here. Yeah. Then we're passing parameter. We'll call it ID. And this is gonna be one. Okay. Well. So I'll call this view. So let me quickly create my view. Let's say the class, let me use well. So I'll paste. Mm, it's going to be blog. Title for H three. Let's say H two, and I'll make it this P. Then I'll say body content. What did we use here? Um, body. Good, that's how we can easily create a blog and um, probably with an advanced feature. So, remember, this is one topic, this is another topic, but using the same title but different name. That is in case you want to make use of, um, you want to allow duplicate topic, but you want to create different ID for each of them. So, that's a simple blog we just created. So, guys, thank you and see you in our next tutorial.